Fox 59 is your local election headquarters and one of the newest members of the city county council was born in the year 2000. This is Nick Roberts. He's the newly elected representative for the Castleton and Geist areas and his election signals more of a youth led movement in several Indiana cities. Fox 59's Eric Graves sat down with the soon to be youngest member of the Indianapolis City County Council. Nick Roberts isn't your typical 20 something. So for me, I've always had that drive for service in my life. So everybody, Nick Roberts! With 54% of the vote, Roberts became the new representative for District 4 in the northeast corner of Indianapolis. It envelops the Castleton and Geist areas. I knew it would be a long shot, but I knew regardless of what happened, nobody could outwork me for this campaign. When most 23-year-olds are starting careers out of school and enjoying all the freedom of their early 20s, Roberts sees this as his time. Being young, I, I, you know, I, this is a perfect opportunity to really make a difference and just give back to the community. We will do better! Roberts joins Terre Haute Mayor-elect Brandon Sackman in making local election headlines. Sackman is just 27 years old. We are going to relentlessly fight to make the city of Terre Haute better again in the number one city in West Central Indiana. Laura Wilson, an associate professor of political science at University of Indianapolis, says there seems to be a youth movement lately in politics. I think voters are interested in fresh new ideas and energy as much as they are experience. Wilson says this is great. More young people holding office should lead to more young people voting. You see a candidate you can really resonate with. It's not your dad's age or your grandparents' age. right? This is someone who probably has a lot of experiences similar to you. Roberts hopes his time on the City County Council can inspire more people his age to get involved in politics. Ultimately, it's our future, and local politics is where the difference is made the most. Um, so really, the involvement the need to get involved is so high. He will officially be sworn into the City County Council in January. He's ready to go now, though. I look forward to being an advocate for things in my district that are specific to it, while still being a citywide advocate for things that benefit the greater Indianapolis. In Indianapolis, Eric Graves, Fox 59 News.